there's nothing more important than the protection of wildlife and the biodiversity that exists on our planet. If we lose these species, we lose our home. Technology is going to play a critical role in our success in bringing back and protecting wild areas and biodiversity. Conservation is the opportunity and responsibility of us all. Sea turtles are still uh, really unknown for most of the people. Science started to study them less than 70 years ago. They remain a big mystery to discover. People don't know really uh, how much turtles are in risk. Of the seven species, six are considered in great risk of extinction. We were the first group to take care of these animals in Italy. Now, after 20 years, there are more than 30 rescue centers to protect and study turtles. The rhino poaching crisis is a global catastrophe. At the start of the 20th century, there were over 500,000 rhino in the wild, and today we have less than 30,000. Kariha Game Reserve was 21 different farms, rewilded to create this expansive 11,500 hectare protected wilderness. The 2nd of March 2012 was a real life-changing moment on this reserve. Uh, three poachers came onto the reserve and attacked three rhino. One rhino died on the night, and then sadly, 24 days later, the bull passed away. And Tandi, the cow, she survived. Tandi's horrific poaching was the catalyst to the creation of the Karika Foundation and the establishment of our anti-poaching unit. The high vision cameras are the eyes and the ears of the reserve and they enable us to survey, to monitor and protect in a way that we as humans simply can't do. They are quite a huge asset for us because we can monitor all the sensitive spots in, in our game reserve from an ops room. In our rescue centers in Lampedusa, there are 16 cameras. Thanks to this new technology, we can guarantee security for our animals and develop innovative projects that can help us to understand a lot better the ethology, the behavior of sea turtles. Hack vision play a really important role in other projects globally. For example, they're involved in monitoring the bar-headed goose in China and also in the rehabilitation of the African penguin here in South Africa. What's really exciting is that technology is evolving quickly. When I think about the role that technology and camera technology is going to play in the future, it makes me so much more confident. What has made Tandi's story so powerful is that she showed this just incredible courage and will to survive and has gone on to gift us with four calves. She shows you that with the right care, with the right circumstances, with the right protection, we can bring this rhino species back. Life is interconnected. Our survival is strongly connected to the survival and protection of the other species. What gives me hope is that we have all of the creativity with the right partnerships, technology, and the right shift in consciousness in the world, we will together succeed.